Yo, 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 what is going on, YouTube? It is your boy KP here, coming back at you with the Katowice 2019 major pick and predictions for the Legend stage. Let's get right into the video. Alright, guys, so you're gonna wanna be in my Discord. The reason is I changed my picks from the video I posted. My Discord is in the description right there it's also going to be the first comment it'll be pinned just scroll down find my discord join it the reason being is because for the last video i posted i actually ended up changing my picks i changed wind strike to vitality and i changed vega squadron to avangar so because of that i actually got six out of nine points and we completed the challenge for the first stage of the major um, and if you're not in my discord you might have missed that so i apologize i know my picks were a little whack for the last video I completely rushed it, won't happen again. Make sure you're in my Discord and you will know if I change my picks. We also have a really good community on there. EU, United States, Australia, we all talk about the Pick'em Challenge, we all watch the Major. It's fun, it's whatever. I really hope you guys join the Discord, I recommend it entirely. Anyways, let's get right into the Legend stage. This stage is looking really scary. There's a lot of good teams here. I think almost anyone can beat anyone. And because of that, my picks are going to be really thought out here. I really looked into this, guys. I know my shit. Let's get right into this. I'm going to leave the 3-0 blank for now. I'm going to go straight into the 0-3 pick. And my pick for 0-3 is actually going to be complexity. Uh, the reason being is because at the last two tournaments, E-League and I by Power, they didn't win a single map. And I think the closest score was like 16-12 or 16-14. Um, they honestly did not look impressive at all. I really like Nothing and Shazam, but out of all the teams here, I don't think Complexity can win a map. Like, Complexity, 0-3, um, Avangar, maybe 0-3, and, and honestly, all these other teams can win a map. So, Complexity is the weakest here, that's why I'm going with them, that's my 0-3. Uh, they're really not a great NA team. And I don't, they're only here because they popped off at the last major. Okay, the remaining seven teams that will advance. So remember, we only need five points correct. The teams have to win two best of ones and one best of three. So I'm going to pick seven teams that I think will 100% go through, or at least five of them will 100% go through. So that way we're guaranteed the five correct points for the Pick'em Challenge. Let's go straight down the list. Astralis. Number one team in the world, returning major champions. There should be no reason that they don't make it through to the playoff stage of the major. Easy. Liquid. Liquid's the number two team in the world, best North American team. There should be no reason that they don't make it through unless there's huge upsets that happen. MIBR. Five-man Brazilian roster. They're looking really nice. They're looking really sick. Um, I really think they're going to be back on the form. And they should make it through 100% unless there's huge upsets that happen. FaZe Clan. They're looking weak with Adren, but honestly, I still think they should be going into the playoffs. They are, they're too talented, they have too much skill in that lineup to not make playoffs. Even if Adren shits the fucking bed, FaZe Clan should make the top 8. I think those four right there, 1 million percent, should be going through. I think that's four guaranteed points, and unless they literally have their monitors off and they're not shooting back. Now, these final three, I'm gonna base off what I saw in the challenger stage and what I think in terms of matchups. Firstly, I'm gonna go with NRG. They're ranked number five in the world. They went three and zero in the challenger stage. I think they look lights out, super solid. I'm very confident that they can get through this stage and make the playoffs 3-1 to one or 3-2. to two. They should be getting three wins. It's my sixth pick, Ents. It's too easy for Ents, guys. I'm so on board the easy for Ents train. They're looking really, really good. Their nuke is great. Their dust 2 is great. Their mirage was pretty solid. Uh, honestly, I know they lost the Renegades, but I think that was just an off day. Renegades popped off. I really believe Ents is the better team, and I think Ents will make it through this stage 3-2, to two, if not 3-1 to one or better. Um, my final pick, 
Now my final pick is a little weird because I've heard rumors about Navi and how uh, Zeus is planning about retiring and Simple unfollowed Zeus on Instagram and their boot camp went terrible. Zeus said in an HLTV interview, he said, oh, nobody's treating this like a major. We're just treating it like another tournament. Doesn't look good for me. They lost 0-2 to North at the Ice Challenge Series. Um, really just not good results. So I'm actually not going to pick Navi here because I don't think they're taking it seriously. For my seventh pick at the, about the teams that will advance, I'm actually going to go with Big Clan. And the reason is, is because the new big lineup looks sick, especially with Xanteras, and they brought back Nex for Smuya. I mean, honestly, NIP, G2, and Cloud9 choked in the challenger stage. They barely made it 3-2. and two. Barely. And then I'm looking at the remaining teams of Renegades, Avangar, and Vitality, and head-to-head, -head, I think Big Clan wins those matchups. They're a higher-rated team than Avangar, Vitality, and Renegades. So I think on paper, Big Clan is this better pick, the safer pick, if you will. Um, Renegades has been looking lights out. Vitality was hit and miss. They were down 13-2 to Greyhound, but brought it back, so I don't know about that. Um, and Avangar, I mean, they won a couple BO1s, and they won one BO3. I, I don't know. I don't think Avangar would be a great pick. Uh, I don't see him making the top 8 of the major. Uh, my reasoning for not picking NIP, G2, or C9, while I think one of them is bound to make the top 8, just because of upsets and how the major works, they just didn't impress me at all. G2 looks terrible. They almost lost to Tai Lu. Cloud9 almost lost to Windstrike. They barely made it through as well. And NIP were down 1 and 2, went 2 to 1 against Vici. They just didn't impress me at all. So I, I don't trust them in being one of the seven teams that will advance. So these this is my own three. These are my seven teams that will advance. If I change anything, you want to be in my Discord. That's where I will update everyone first. I do not post update videos on the Pick'em Challenge. I will try and respond in the comments if I update them. I really believe these are solid fucking picks right here. Like, really solid, boys. As long as nobody chokes and eats dick for breakfast, these are good. My 3-0. Let me explain the 3-0. So the 3-0 is really hard to predict because anyone can be anyone. And I already said I don't trust Navi to be one of the seven teams that will advance. So, for example, right, I could put Astralis as my 3-0, but then let's say they lose a map to Liquid in the 2-0, like, group stage, then I don't get a point for Astralis. So I'm putting Astralis for a guaranteed point, and I'm going to go with Navi for the 3-0, just on the fucking whim that they show up and they're not triggered Russians and they actually win the games. So these are my final picks for now. I'm locking these in. I really hope you guys enjoy. Sorry about the last video. I definitely rushed that way too fast. Going as I apologize. But uh, anyways, guys, these are my picks for now. Join my fucking Discord. Let's bang. We already got the challenger stage. Correct. We got all our five points. We got the match. We got our souvenir case. We're hype, baby. All right, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button. It really helps me out. We are so close to 3,000 subscribers. Smack that sub button. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.